for Canada Cup 1992. We're getting set for the final in the 63 and a half K class between a smiling Fitzroy Vanderpool and Scotland's Jim Pender. I guarantee that when the action starts, the smiles will quickly disappear. For a number of years now, the one they call the Whip Fitzroy Vanderpool has been a perennial runner-up to Mark LaDuke in the 63.5K class, but he is fighting for the gold medal here at the Canada Cup, and there is his opponent, Jim Pender of Scotland, who is competing in his third Canada Cup and looking for his first medal. And I like the chances for Fitzroy Vanderpool to win a medal in this one, Patrick McCrory of Dublin, Ireland will be the referee as Fitzroy Vanderpool, the whip, goes for gold against Jim Pender of Scotland in the 63 and a half kilo weight class division. Steve, this Fitzroy is, as you know, one of my most favorite fighters on the national team. He, he exemplifies in and out of the ring what boxing is all about. A good style, nice combinations, works hard, nice defense. I'm This guy is going to go a lot further than people think he will. This guy's got a bright, if he, if he stays right, this guy's got a bright future ahead of him, whether it be in the pros or in the amateurs. And with combinations and flurries like that, he's going to be Pender of Scotland if he continues. He has a 1-0 lead early in the first round. The whip, Fitzroy Vanderpool with the blue top, red trunks, against Jim Bender of Scotland with the red top and the blue trunks. And I notice that the whip, who normally wears one red boot and one blue boot, has gone to two blue. Well, I think, actually, those are the boots that are provided by the national team, so I guess they didn't want to give him two pairs. The others he bought, those were provided to him free of charge. He uses such an array of punches. He'll, he'll slip shots, he'll go down to the body, he'll come up to the head, he'll stay behind the jab, he'll throw flurries of punches. He's tall, he's lean. He's got everything going for him to be a great, great fighter. One of the finest fighters this country's produced right here. Still one nothing favoring Fitzroy Vanderpool of Canada. And it's Jim Bender on Scotland. Jim Pender is another perennial Canada Cup guy. He's been here before, but has yet to pick up a medal. Well, he's got one now. Now it's only the determination of what color it'll be. Oh, good overhand right by Fitzroy. Nice flurries. You see that right to the body, then back up to the head. Vanderpool leading 3-2. Oh, body shot again. Dear, oh, dear. And a caution there from Patrick McCrory, the referee from Dublin, Ireland. Oh, body shot again. Oh, good right hand by Pender, right over the top. He tries it again, and there's the body shot. Fitz stopped his last opponent on those body shots. Beautiful underneath with the other hand. Those combinations are scoring for Fitzroy Vanderpool of Canada. He now leads 6-3. First round action, 63 and a half kilo class final. Good stiff jab landed also. There's the right hand again by Pender. And that scored. It is now 6-4, favor the Canadian in the blue top. Again the right hand. That one didn't score though, but that landed. Underneath, beautiful shot. 6 4. Fitzroy Vanderpool of Canada leads Jim Pender of Scotland after one round. There's the body shots. Oh, dear, oh, dear, those things gotta hurt. They gotta take some wind out of you. He's getting good leverage on them, and he comes up right underneath, right underneath in between the two gloves. Oh! Hey, coach, catch your breath. Second round underway in the 63 and a half kilo final between Fitzroy Vanderpool of Canada, the one they call the whip. He's got the blue top on, the red trunks, and he's in against Jim Fender of Scotland. As the second round is nicely underway, Vanderpool has a two-point lead, six to four. He has a two-point lead, and Pender's got some sore ribs from those body shots. Low blow there. 
That was legit. The way Fitzroy Vanderpool is fighting right now, it's very difficult to believe that he is not going to be representing Canada at the Olympics in Barcelona. He looks very good. Oh, he looks excellent. He's so he's got he's got everything. He can do everything in the ring. Not taking away anything from Mark LeDuc. Mark did beat him in the box office and earned his right to represent Canada. Uh, Fitzroy got the first win, and Mark came back for the second one and won the fight and earned his right to represent this country at the Olympics. But as far as a prospect is concerned, and a future, this young kid is going to go places. So for Fitzroy Vanderpool, this may well indeed be his Olympics, the Canada Cup here in Ottawa. Oh, he's proving, he's proving right now to everybody, and he's, he's proving what I've believed for a long time. This guy has world-class potential. And right now, he has got a 9-5 lead on Jim Pender of Scotland in the second round. Oh, nice jabs to the body. There it is again, the jab downstairs. Vanderpool has been most effective when he's gone to the body of Pender. And as you pointed out, Russ, I think that tends to take its toll. Oh, it has to. And if it, if it doesn't take its toll, what happens, Steve, is the fighter, the, the opponent starts looking for the body shots, drops his elbows a little bit, therefore exposing the chin. Now, you see, Pender wants to have no part of any inside fighting. As you can see, he's trying to stay on his bicycle on the outside. He doesn't want to have anything to do with Fitzroy on the inside because those body shots, he felt those body shots in the first round. And he'd need a 12 speed to stay away from Vanderpool because he can move. And also throw punches, a standing eight count now from the referee, Patty McCrory from Dublin, Ireland to Jim Pender of Scotland. A nice flurry by Fitzroy. Body and head kept Pender back, pinned to the ropes. The referee had no alternative but to move in and give him the eight count. The gold medal at stake here in the 63 and a half kilo final. Fitzroy Vanderpool of Canada with a blue top. And there's a devastating blow from Vanderpool that sends Pender down to one knee, but they're not Rory, the referee it. says, fight on. He did not count it. Oh, that was a right hand for sure. There's a left hook. And again, he doesn't count it. He just says, come on, fight. He's going to let him fight. I said left hook. It was actually a right hook. Fitzroy was in a southpaw, southpaw stance when he hit him with that. 13-8 is the score. Favor the Canadian, Fitzroy Vanderpool. Third rounds in this bout. We lost power to our trucks here in Ottawa, so we have no main cameras. So we've got one camera up at ringside, Russ, and that's how we're going to show you the remainder of the third round. 